We belong together. Hi everyone. So today I'm doing a get right with me. As you can tell by the title, you know what some things I'm gonna be talking about. Slash vlog. So I'm just gonna start off with a what's it called again? Sheet mask. It's a gel mask actually. I never used this before. So I got this from Bath and Body Works. So hopefully it's good because it's, you know, if and body work. Yeah, I'm supposed to be going out with my friends today. Ooh, this feels like weird. See, I cannot wait till I go to college. I know I'm saying this now and later I'll probably be like, well, I don't know. Why would I say that? So right now I have my hair. <coughs> well, I just did my, I just, <coughs> woo, dang. That mess was okay. Dang, what the heck is wrong with my voice? I had more hydrating masks before. The ones from Walmart are more hydrating than that. No shade, no teeth off. Facts. <coughs> you know, I remember one time I did that. And my best friend was like, you sound like you starting up a car. Just hope I don't break out from it. As you can see, my skin is in the clear. The one thing right here. And on my nose, of course. This one's that need to go away because I had this for a minute. But my skin is quite clear. I just have like discoloration. I know nobody asks for my opinion, but still, I'm, st I'm still gonna give it because that's the type of world we live in. I've been watching a lot of Jazzy Lee on YouTube. I really love her videos. It's so like aesthetically pleasing, and she's so pretty. I just love her YouTube videos. The next is foundation, of course. I'm not going to be naming the products, but I did do a, like an everyday makeup routine that you guys can check out. The situation at hand is Kai and Jenny. Kai from EXO and Jenny from Blackpink are dating. What's my opinion? Honestly, when I first heard it, I was so surprised. I was like... <laughs> I mean, I'm not like, like, Kai is one, it's like in my top two. I like so, it's him and Dio that's tied. I mean, they, him, Kai and Dio are like both my t number ones. And when I found out Kai was dead, Jenny, I was like, oh, really? I'm not mad or nothing. It's not like I'm a crazy obsessed man. Like, you can't date nobody but me. La la la. I'm going to kill her. I'm going to kill you. La la la. We belong together. I'm not like that. But I was hella like, I wasn't hurt. I was just surprised. I'm like, damn. Y'all really got a girlfriend. And I was happy that he got a girlfriend. But I, w I was worried about how the public would take it over there. You know? Because they don't like that. They do not like that. Some of these fans be so controlling. Like, y'all. Who y'all think y'all are? To be telling them when they can date and when they can't. Like, come on now. Grow up. That's so, like, immature. And toxic, honestly. It's taking very well. A lot of people, like, every... I, I, I ain't see. The only comments I seen that was like, oh... Hate, I guess, was like he only dating her to teach her how to dance and stuff like that. See, that was funny to me, cause you know Jenny be performing lazy at times. I guess whenever she have her bad days, everybody have bad days. But at the same time, this is your this is your um career and this is your job. You supposed to people buy tickets. Nobody want to see you just standing there and not doing nothing, or the other three are doing things. Cause then it's not like a bunch of them in that group, you know. It's only four people in Blackpink. So if one of them lacking, it's really easy to point out. and really easy to see that one of them is not doing what they're supposed to be doing. Which makes the rest of them look sloppy and like just a mess. It makes the rest of them look a mess. Like, why is she not doing that? And why y'all not doing that? Why y'all not telling her? You better start dancing or something. I don't care. But Jenny, honestly, Jenny is my favorite from Blackpink. But her lazy performances, she need to get that to go on. I was like, she get a solo, don't know how to act. These are all jokes I'm saying. If you're offended by this, just just grow up. Just learn how to take a joke. I was really surprised by how well the um 
the K nuts and like you know XOLs and Blinks was taking it. I was like, wow. So not even trying to compare the two situations. I know I'm gonna people gonna be commenting like, um, first of all, it's different, but it's crazy how easily they got accepted or whatever by the public. Whereas my man's Edon and, and I don't know how to say her name. Hana, Hana, hi. Uh, uh. It's street. Everybody was mad. I guess it was, I don't know why people was really that mad because I don't think it was something to be that mad about. But that's my opinion. It's not. Like, I hate how idols can't date nobody. Like, who do y'all think y'all are controlling them? The only reason why I could see they don't, the companies don't want idols to date is because they might get distracted or whatever. That's understandable. Like, how parents don't be wanting their kids to date because... They want them to focus on school. And I'm like, okay, that's understandable. However, the only reason I can really think of, and other than the fans are crazy, but not all fans, obviously, and they make the rest of them look bad, period. Was, how was Kai and Jenny different from um, Hunter? Uh, I think that's how you say her name. And Edon. This is my opinion. I'm not trying to say that people are picking favorites, but I feel like people are picking favorites, but... Because, like, why when people from two big companies pop out and say they dating, from the top three companies, they say they dating, it's okay. But when people, other people don't, it's like, oh, no, y'all can't be doing this. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Like, they literally got put out of queue because they was dating. Public was mad. So, basically, that really got them put out. Because they swear, like, why do y'all want to be in everybody else's business? Like, mind your business. Like, stay in your lane. Period. Stay in your lane. Period. Just because they go together. And then I watch these videos, like, why I and Jenny Dayton is different from something. I don't remember the name. And it was like, because the fans are more mature now, so they don't really care. All right, okay. All right, okay. All right. Why was nobody mature with um Edon and freaking the girl? It wasn't really them saying, oh yeah, I hate y'all, I'ma kill y'all. Well, nobody was really saying, I'ma kill y'all, but I hate y'all, uh-uh, uh-uh, break up, uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. I think, and then it was like, on the video, I was like, well, it's different also, because Big Young from XO. When he, he was dating a girl to yarn and the white like that. So he got shamed or whatever. And they had to break up too. <laughs> but the person that wrote the video was like, oh, it's probably because they was, they was rookies. And you know, they didn't like that, how their career was just starting. And he was dating somebody that was way popular to him. One on one disbanded. I actually saw one on one. At KCON New York, I went there. Just, I mainly went there for NCT, but you know, other people there too. It was EXID, Miss Nine, Golden Child. See, I'm still not into them yet. I still need, I need to get into them. The two groups, Golden Child and From Miss Nine, they did a good job without being that big, you know. I, I mainly went there for NCT. I had a good time. I love NCT, you guys. If you don't know that, if you don't know, now you know. I remember everything. It was so much fun. Just my seats was so high. I just wish I was close to the lawn. Be like, hey, 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 buddy, buddy, pit, like, check, ball, feel it. Also, one day I will do a room tour. <laughs> it just, my room is usually, well, my room, it's not usually dirty, but it's like, it can get straightened up a little, you know. Oh, yeah, I have a cherry bomb poster up here. It's on the wall. It, I don't know if you guys ever seen it. If you watch my old videos when my camera used to fall and you could see up there, <laughs> that's when you could see it. I got it from KCON. Wavy, NCT. PR. Debut they seen. And I, I don't. Wow. I just can't believe it. But yeah, they debut and scene, and I'm so happy. Please support them. Especially my man's win win. We need to support my man's win win because that's my man, y'all. And then that already spoke about the Jenny Kai situation. 
give my opinion. I support them. They deserve to be happy. It's just K nuts are some wishy washy. Blank blank. See you in like one second. Okay, so I just finished my makeup. And this is how it looks. These are the Lily Lashes in Miami. But right now, I'm about to go downstairs, take some pics, because the sun is out right now. Then I'm going to clean the bathroom. And then I'm going to eat and put on my clothes. So the sun wasn't actually out. So that's a bummer. But this is my bed right here. Hold on. This is my bed very messy I'll do like my side of the room toward my post also I might be wearing these shoes today these Pumas I washed them yesterday but not washed but like scrubbed them with my brush see that yellow right there it was way more pigmented than that so this is how the outfit looks I'm wearing this necklace right here from what is this from Forever 21, I've been got this. I learned this long sleeve shirt from Route 21. These, this belt is from, yeah, this belt is from Walmart. It's really cute. These jeans is from Forever 21 also. They high waisted. That's how it looks. I didn't do my hair. I need to fix my eyelids because it's coming off. Looks. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I know this looks. I think it's cute. Oh, I just realized my orange hair go with my shirt because that's cute. I'm gonna be in the video right here. So if you guys like it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below for more. If you like me showing my outfits as I do my makeup, just comment down below and I'll do more of that. So bye. Thank <laughs> you.